People in one part of the Midlands are getting free electricity and the electricity companies are paying for it. A company run by volunteers is fitting solar panels on council houses. Well, it's being paid for by green taxes, something we all pay on our bills, but which the power companies must pass on for schemes like solar power. Mark Goff reports. Even on a cold grey day in January, there's enough sun to produce electricity from solar panels. And they're helping to cut high fuel prices here in Cannock. Roy Mayju's signed up for a scheme to have solar panels on his council bungalow. He won't have to pay a penny and... You get free electricity, you can save probably 100 or 200 pounds a year on your bill. How does that sound? That sounds absolutely <laughs> lovely. <laughs> this company, which is run by volunteers, will pay for and fit the solar panels on up to 400 council houses in Cannock. Any savings on the electric and gas like is absolutely magic for me. Cannock Chase Council has agreed that some of their council houses can be used for the scheme. Mike Kingan started it because he's concerned about the environmental effects of burning fossil fuels. Helping the environment is also helping householders in Cannock. We install the panels, we maintain them, we look after them, they get the free electricity, that's the deal. We think that people will save probably £150, maybe £200 a year in their electricity bills. So that's something like 40-50% of what they're paying at the moment. The solar panel company is backed by investors who are getting 7% a year return on their investment. How can Mike afford to pay such a return? Well, on all of our fuel bills, we all pay a little bit extra in green taxes. But the energy companies must pass these taxes on to schemes like this one in Cannock. Every quarter we will tell our electricity company, Good Energy, how much electricity has been produced by all the solar panels that we own and they will pay us £400 for each property. That's £400 a quarter for every house with solar panels and don't forget there might be 400 in Cannock on this scheme. Roy was so impressed that as well as agreeing to have the panels fitted later this year, he's invested some of his life savings in the scheme. The company is trying to raise another quarter of a million pounds to do more houses in Cannock, helping more people like Roy. Markov, ITV News.